This winter has been extremely hard on the roses, but you know, we had a beautiful snowpack and you think that would have protected them, but I think the real culprit was the week before that snowpack when it was really, really cold. It dehydrated all the canes. Look how black they are. And remove all these canes. Just start cutting them down. It makes it much easier to work around the rose bush with you don't have to deal with all the thorns and those great big long canes. Now, once you get those down, start removing the mulch that you had around them and go as deeply as you can, almost to the top of the bud unions. That way we can get good new cane break coming up, if, especially if a lot of the canes died back. Now we need to go in and do the fine pruning. Look at this branch here. It looks like there's a little bit of green on it, but there's also a lot of black. I need to go down. I'm not even going to look for buds right now. All I'm looking for is good, clean tissue. You notice how nice and green that is, that means this cane is alive. If I go there, oh, no, that's dead. And then notice here we've got a cut in the bark, and this is nice and green. This too will need to go. So you start doing the fine pruning. Anything that is black, you need to go below that until you get where you have good green, clean tissue. That's the most important thing. Even if it means taking those roses all the way down to the top of the bud union, they will come back. So don't give up on your roses this year, but get that pruning done now. I'm Phyllis Stevens, and that's our great garden tip.